Thanks. Take you ten days. More like two weeks. Why don't you hear in ten days? You get your wheat, Kit. Proper non time. At this morning, the mood throughout the state among farmers is, in a word, tense. Of hey, what's so important you got to hear about a Pacific storm front over and over? Well, you live by the weather. <laughs> it rains in Seattle. Yeah, it's moving southeast. It comes this far to make the sunflowers grow, right? If it comes this far, it could ruin a lot of farmers. Too much rain can spoil ripe grain. Strong winds will knock the kernels off the stalks. Lightning will set the fields afire. Tornadoes spin Dorothy up the Wizard of Oz. You being smart? Yeah. Hey, I'm sorry. I mean, I just, uh, I guess there's a lot more to making a lump of bread than I ever thought much about. <laughs> Don't grow on supermarket shelves, that's for sure. How much are you going up this time, Andy? You know the price of me there and I do. See you later, Colby. Yeah, it's all good. There you are. Yeah, thank you, bud. See you again. Bye-bye now. You're welcome. Ah, take some. Oh, thanks. Now, take a big hunk. I got friends from bakeries from here in Montana. That there's what, what Harvston wheat's all about. Well, hungrier than I thought. You know, slicing it, that'll, that'll cut half the flavor out. You want a job cutting wheat? Uh, no. Oh, thanks. <laughs> well, I got an open spot on my crew. <laughs> well, thanks anyway, Blake. I think this is all the harvesting I want to do. <laughs> just like that in my garage back home? Over 30 grand. Of course, that's just about a month's work for me. See, I'm a model, male model. You know, magazine covers, billboards, stuff like that. You, uh, you want to live back there in Pratt? Yeah. Yeah, right, it's one of my latest accounts. Hey, you know why I'm in such big demand? Because I can give me a look. Yeah, sure. You want a California surfer for a beer commercial? I blow dry my hair, smile, ha-ha, <laughs> I'm golden. Yeah, want a mystery man for a French perfume man? Slick the hair back. What's this? Hey, you want a sailor? That's me. Cowboy? Me. Plastic dummy to hang your stupid clothes on? That's me too. I can be anybody. What kind of trouble are you in, son? Mister? I got no job, and I got nothing coming up, and I got about 18 bucks in my pocket. That's the truth. A very angry lady I left in Pratt, Kansas. Claims that's not even mine. Get your bus ticket. Uh, thanks anyway. I appreciate it. Well, 70 East, just block up the street there. Good luck to you. Well, I'm gonna have to get out from under, I guess, for a spell hard. Uh... Doctor wants me in for surgery Friday. Nothing serious, I hope. 
time. He wants me in Friday. Yeah, I'm getting a bit worried. Bank's got a note on that new equipment. If uh, you don't keep busy, the full harvest is... Uh... Well, I know, I know. I, I could default and, uh, and wind up with nothing. Howard, you've got uh, contacts in, in this business. I'd appreciate it if you'd line up some young fellow for me, like uh, Sonny Myers or Don Ray... <coughs> Don Ray Hall, that somebody that could just step right in. Some and kind of foreman. Well, yeah, or even uh, buy in as a partner. I'm going to have to be pulling together some cash. Well, Bud, uh, money's pretty scarce right now. Uh, I'd say you're in a bit of a bind. I think I don't know. Unless, of course, uh, you consider uh, selling out like the Toby brothers just did. I mean, uh, Pete Albers no, uh, no. building his own. No, 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 there's no way that I'm going to put my outfit on Pete Albert's plate. Got himself some uh, trouble out there, huh? Homer Dunbar still judge around here? Yeah, why? How come you helped me? Oh, life's short. Oh, thanks. Hey, uh, listen, where are we headed here? Base camp. <laughs> you weren't serious about me harvesting wheat. You took the jab. Yeah, I know, but that was just for the judge, right? Hmm. But come on, one phone call to New York's all I need to get you a check. How much was it you put out? $391 in fines and court costs. Yeah, I make 100 an hour modeling, so I'll send it to you. No sweat. Oh, there's plenty of sweat. <laughs> So, uh, I'll pay you when I get back to New York, right? No, no, money's not the point. I'm a man short on my crew. You promised that you'd work off that debt, and that's what you're going to do. You are serious. Man's words is bond. What are you going to do if I walk? <laughs> well, don't decide the road here. Tell Judge where to pick you up. Hey, come on, man. I'm no farmer. Hey, smile. Harvesting wheat's a picnic compared to 30 days on the road, gang. Well, finally, what took you so long? I was starting to worry about you. Just how long am I your prisoner? How about the 4th of July? That's good Independence Day. What'd you do while you were gone besides not get yourself a haircut? Oh, just tending the business. Larry, here's coming to work for us. Willingly? What happened to number four? Oh, internal injuries that swallowed this humongous rock. That's not funny. Don't take us two or three days to get parts. We've already had too much downtime. Get Larry bedroll and some work clothes and then see if you can get a, a hot supper on the table. Will you sure give Nick the orders? <laughs> You must have quit smoking again. Yeah, maybe it's the full moon. I'm Marlene. Larry. <laughs> this is incredible. All new, exciting, how can I describe it? Yeah, well, it's a real thrill for me, too. Come on. Come on. Where are you from? I, uh, I yo-yo around a lot. Yeah, so do we. Pasco, Texas, up to Sunburst, Montana every year for the wheat harvest, then down south for the soybean harvest. Yeah, it sounds exotic. <laughs> well, here's where you've gone. <laughs> Wonderful. Not exactly the plaza, is it? No, but the smells are masculine. <laughs> hey, sugar, just say the word you and me. We'll do a little harvesting on our own yeah. here. Right. Dick, for sugar pumps, come on. You know what I mean? Go away. Uh, come on, boys. We'll be boys. Why not? I don't believe this. Yeah, mess around with ah. the boss's daughter. That's an easy way to get the flow job. Oh, oh, leave me alone. Oh, oh, oh man. Man. I'll tell you, one more day like okay here. Uh, uh, not quite. Very New boy, sleep up top. Hey, guys, you know I can't get to sleep when I have my baseball glove. You want to put it back when you're done? Sorry about that. Oh, hey, welcome baby. to the sweat box. My name's Billy. Lawrence Kendall. Lawrence. 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 Lawrence of Kansas. <laughs> hey, Lawrence. Russ. How you doing? How'd you get the shine? Oh, it's, uh, Three guys in a bar, jumping in. Uh, oh, just three. Three. Yeah. Oh, I'm sure to see the other three girls. <laughs> <laughs> Name's Dwight. Surely, right. Dwight's an Indian. Oh. 
Oh, <laughs> after Eisenhower announced yeah, tribe no, suing no. the government for past injustice. Very funny, Sonny the Honey, also known as the Marachino Cherry. Hey, is that funny still guy. true, Sonny? Hey, you worked the harvest before? Uh, no, I did a little lumberjacking up in Oregon. Ah, uh, let me just start on the shelf, man. I'm free. Yeah. Hey, put it to me, man. Hey, put it to me, man. Are you hey, a sailor? Wait a minute, look at these hands, Captain Wheat. Soft as a baby. Week, pal. <laughs> That's the shovel. It's well, shovel is all over. Over. Sleep shovel. good tonight, lumberjack. Because tomorrow you're going to want to die. <laughs> right on. You ever been to San Francisco? <laughs>